A spot in the knockout stage of the 2023 AFC Asian Cup is within reach for four-time champions Japan as they battle Iraq today at the Education City Stadium. The borders that separate us are just um, man-made and in reality we as a people are all one. Uh, so Palestine, Iraq, all in, in between, we're all one and we're always going to support each other. Culturally and histo historically we have a lot of similarities together. I mean, like it even goes back hundreds of centuries ago with both of our civilizations, our shared history, our shared struggles. I think that we have a chance that we can maybe compete in this tournament. Despite the off start, Japan found its groove and bounced back from the early scare to claim a 4-2 victory. Meanwhile, Iraq marched towards the tournament after nearly 20 years of winning the first and only AFC title. So, will there be an upset on this field? Will Iraq take down the AFC tournament favorites Japan and seal their place in the round of 16? Only one way to find out. Man, I feel crazy. The game was amazing. The player put like 200%. You know, they put all, all of the efforts. You know, I, I don't want to say like we didn't expect to win because we won 2007, you know, against Australia. And I think now the tournament in our hands. Go Lion! You know? Iraqi, hayo! Hayo, Iraqi, hayo! Hayo, Iraqi, hayo! Hayo, Iraqi, hayo! The cup is for us! They did it. Iraq did what many thought they couldn't as they defeated football favorites Japan 2-1. It was the passion of the fans and the spirit of the footballers that led to the win as flags of Iraq were raised high and loud here at the Education City Stadium. You could hear the chants ringing throughout the stadium as it was clear that this was more than just a simple game. It was a statement. Anything and everything is possible. Muhammad Al-Tayb, Dawah News.